In the town of Hamelin, the mayor and the townspeople lived happily until one day, a mysterious flute player known as the Pied Piper arrived. He offered his services to rid the town of its rat infestation, promising a magical solution. Intrigued, the mayor and the townspeople eagerly accepted his offer. The Pied Piper stood at the center of town, playing a mesmerizing melody on his flute. As he played, the rats were hypnotized by the enchanting music and began following him in a trance-like state. The Pied Piper led the rats to the river, where they drowned, disappearing from the town forever. The mayor, impressed by the Pied Piper's abilities, offered him a generous reward as promised. However, the Pied Piper declined the monetary offer and instead requested something far more valuable, the fair payment of his services. The mayor, disregarding the Piper's request, insisted that the promised sum was satisfactory. Enraged by the mayor's betrayal, the Pied Piper devised a plan to seek revenge. Under the moonlit sky, the Pied Piper once again played his magical tune, but this time it was not the rats that followed him, it was the unsuspecting children of Hamelin. Mesmerized by the music, the children trailed behind the Pied Piper as he led them out of town, never to be seen again. When the mayor and the townspeople realized what had happened, they were gripped with despair and remorse. The once vibrant town of Hamelin now stood empty, devoid of its children. The mayor, burdened by guilt, vowed to find and bring back the lost children, but all efforts were in vain. Little did the mayor and the townspeople know that the Pied Piper had led the children to a hidden magical realm, where they lived happily under his care. The Pied Piper had rewarded the children for their innocence and trust, away from the injustice and negligence of their former home. The End